Hello, hello there, guys. This is Terrorantor, and today it is my pleasure to welcome you to another episode of Terrorantor Plays Minecraft. So, we've done a little bit of work here, uh, off-camera. I just laid out the plan for, for my bedroom, which is going to be here, looking at the sunset, like I was talking about. Where you raise these walls all around here a little bit, this is going to be the walking path. And I also laid out the floor plan for this room, which is going to be a library. And if we dig down here, we can see that I, you know, there was that space with all the little everything in it. Yeah, I just, I just lit that up a little bit. And uh, we're just gonna we're just gonna leave that open down there rather than filling it all in with blocks. Um, I also, mm, <clears throat> sorry. Ugh, all right, I also uh, decided to set up a little ceiling here, so I, I don't know, it looks pretty good. But I had to cover up all this nether brick back here. I don't want that visible, so looks pretty good, I think. Uh, also, one last thing I did. Actually, let's let's sleep really quick in one of the in one of the servants' beds here. Mine. No, mm, uh. Surely it's nighttime. What? There we go. All right, let's go look at this one other quick little change I made. Uh, I just watching my episode. I felt like the things, the sides of the T over here were were a bit empty. So I did what I could. I didn't have a whole lot of freedom, but I just added some little squares. Some itty bitty, beep bop, bow. Some some square action going on there. And uh, I feel like that at least helped. Let's actually look at this from quite a distance. I wish I had ender pearls. So when I say let's look at this from quite a distance, I don't have to run across all these treetops. Let's go right back here and oop, just look up at this. Hmm. I don't know how I feel about it. I wish I could put another block type back there, but it has to be stone brick in, in the background of those two squares. Uh, but yeah, now we're just gonna we're just gonna check some different glass colors for that eye. Right now it's blue, and that's fine. It's a good color, but uh, I think I might want it to be a little bit more sinister. So I want to try black, red, gray, and brown. Uh, unfortunately, I don't have any brown, so I'm gonna have to maybe go on a bit of a quest to try to find some cocoa beans somewhere. So for now, though, we are going to try uh, black and red and gray. And if we really like any of those, we can skip around. All right, so here it is, just just blue, just how it was. And here it is red. Hmm. Hmm. And here it is black. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. All right, and here is gray, which is, like, super see-through, I, I feel. You cannot even see it up around the cobblestone, so not not this one. Um, out of those, though, I don't know which one to go for. It's really hard. <laughs> I do want to try brown. I really want to try brown. I think that'll look pretty good. So we're going to hunt for some uh, cocoa beans. I think I hear a spider around here somewhere. Hello? Oh, there you are, up in the tea. Oh, what a guy. Uh, yeah, so... We're going to make our library today. I decided that's what we're going to focus on. We're going to take care of that before we build ourselves a, a bedroom. But guess what we need for a library, first and foremost? Uh, uh, I'll, I'll give you a quick hint. The answer is an F load of books, all right? That's, that's, that's the... That's, oh, God. Jesus. Basically, I need to start a cow farm over here. Uh, now, I could go back. I could just raid a bunch of villages, take all their books. I could go back, and I could grab all the bookshelves I left uh, back at my previous base, but... I need a cow farm here sooner or later anyways. So what we're going to do, what we're going to do right now, just off camera, I'm going to gather up a bunch of cows. I have some fences. I have some wheat in my inventory. I know there are at least a couple of cows around the area here. Uh, so I'm going to get that cow farm built and also a sugarcane farm. Uh, and then I'll show you some of the progress I've made up above and we can actually start working on a library. And okay, here we have a little bit of a cow farm and a boop and, and a boop and oh my gosh, this creeper eyeing my cows. No, uh no, sir. Mm. Yeah, the thing is, though, guys, we have 30 levels, and taking uh, enough, get, getting enough leather from these guys to uh, fill a library with books could take a long freaking time. Like, oh, man, we're, we're going to go try to enchant ourselves a looting sword. You never know. Maybe we'll get some awesome luck. While we're here, we also go and repair our uh, diamond pickaxe. Boop. Nice. What the F? What killed me? Oh. I had. Uh, oh. 
Well, yeah, as you can uh, hear, my, my game sounds are turned off currently because I was just I was just camping the zombie farm. Hopefully, I didn't die too long ago because I would really not be too happy if I lost all that stuff. I had my good pickaxe on me and everything. Uh, but I guess let's see if I can get that back. It looks like it was still on the ground when I was down there, at least. Hmm. <laughs> I, just, I always play on normal, though. I don't know why I was on... Uh... I guess I was on hard because I was I was just doing something. Oh right, I was trying to speedrun Minecraft a little bit just for fun because I was a little uh, bored one day. But oh yeah, crap! All my stuff is gone. Well, that that's really unfortunate. Uh, I guess I'm going to also enchant a new pickaxe, but I'm gonna have to head back to my castle first to get some more diamonds and stuff. That's a really stupid way to die. Darn it! I am I am sad now. Okay, and we're finally getting back over here. Wow, oh man. Uh, sorry, the video's gonna be up a day later than I planned on. Uh, it was supposed to be up yesterday, but I got a little disheartened by my silly death where I lost uh, a total of nine diamonds. Well, like six regular diamonds and then three in the form of my newly repaired uh, pickaxe there. So I got a little disheartened. I just decided to take a break. Um, I wasn't really upset, I just, I just, like, wanted to play League, you know, rather than, like, grind my way back up to some pig guys. But hey, now I'm back, I just bought all my diamonds, all of them, I've also been picking up some sugarcane as I went, uh, back and forth from my base, ba back to here. Unfortunately, I slept in that bed over there, I sent my spawn, so I wasn't able to just get back to my other base very quickly, I actually swam across the ocean because I forgot a boat, and then I, uh, and then I boated back. But hey, we're back now, we're gonna, we're gonna enchant ourselves, and, oh, hello, Zomber. Oh, he, had, he was holding all of my beef. Thank you. Thank you. Look at that, guys. My beef survived. Thank goodness. Uh, yeah, I do have my game mode. My, my uh, difficulty set to normal now, so I won't starve to death uh, accidentally. But yeah, we're just going to chill here. We're going to just enchant some stuff. We're going to get ourselves another efficiency for and breaking three pickaxe because I really I really want one of those. And we're going to make ourselves a looting sword. <laughs> uh, yeah, sorry about the video being out later. The video being out later than I uh, wanted it to be. Uh, I'm just gonna grind some levels out here, and I'll see you guys pretty soon. Alright, we're going for efficiency 4, unbreaking 3. Come on! Ooh. Hmm. Okay, this time for sure. Come on. Oh. What the... Oh. It's not, it's not that good without the unbreaking 3 on there. That kind of... Hmm, that kind of sucks. Okay, all right. Take three. Take three. We got this. Come on. We want efficiency for it, but we also want... Unbre Even if this is just unbreaking three, I'll be happy, because then we can combine it. Efficiency for unbreaking three. Hot diggity dog. Woohoo! Now, we're going to go for a looting sword. And okay, here we go. With the diamond sword of looting. Looting three! Oh, man. Oh, wow. It is good. It is good. Oh, that's awesome. All right, last last thing we're going to do here really quick before we go back. We're going to combine this. We're going to get efficiency 5, because why not? It, it, you know, I don't want just a random efficiency 4 pickaxe lying around, so we're going to have efficiency 5 on breaking 3, and, uh, and then we can go on back to the base. And a boop, and a boop. 50 oxygen. Let's see how it is the other way. Oh yeah, 21. We definitely want 15 there. And efficiency 5 pickaxe. Nice. And actually, we have we have quite a couple of zombies left over here. Let's see. That's like uh, almost 200 zombies just, just sitting here. So we're actually going to kill the rest of these and maybe do one more level 30 enchantment just to, just to see what we get. Why not, you know? And all right. We just about have another uh, level 30 here. There we go. There we go. And what should we do this time? I'm thinking let's do boots. Let's... Let's try to get some, uh, feather falling. Oh, yeah. Come on. Oh. Well. I guess there are, there are worse enchantments I could have gotten. Although I can't think of any right now. But, uh, I think we actually have enough zombies here. <laughs> for one more. Let's, let's see if we can get another level 30. Alright, guys. I... Oh, wow. Why are my game sounds so good? Yeah, I, I turned the game sounds back on, though. Oh wow, this is glitchy. Uh, yeah, though, I, I didn't have enough zombies here to actually get a level 30 enchantment, but I decided, you know what, hey, let's wait around. So I did, so I did, and I, I grinded up, I, I ground up, I, I don't know how to say that really, but I got up to level 30, 
And I decided that, you know what, I think I know what I'm going to do for my last enchant here. I think we're going to enchant a fishing rod, because that just sounds really freaking cool to me. So let's go see if we have any string back at our, at our base over here. And if we don't, I'll wait around until night, and I'll kill a couple of spiders with my super cool looting three. <laughs> yeah. Uh, Bane of Arthropods 5 sword. I will I will F those spiders up, yo. Like, oh man, it will be freaking brutal. And also now we can we can slaughter any of our cows we have over here. Uh, I've also been, I think I might have already mentioned this, I've been in, uh, collecting any sugar cane that I've seen while I've just been running around for, uh, back and forth from this base to my other one and whatnot. Um, and yeah, I've, I've been uh, collecting some of that stuff. Don't I? String! Ha ha! <laughs> Uh, yeah, fishing rods used to be really lame, but with these new enchants and stuff, and, and the stuff you can catch it, they're pretty cool, pretty cool indeed. Um, so let's go ahead, let's let's enchant this, let's see what we get, and then I'm gonna probably feed these cows, breed them uh, one more time, then I'll kill all the big ones. So we'll still have a couple of cows here in case we ever need a cow farm. Uh, no point in killing all of them, I, uh, I don't think. But yeah, we can, we can looting the three, some cows, and remember guys, that the overall goal of today's episode was actually to work on the library. Um, so I know we've gotten pretty freaking off track, uh, to be entirely honest here. But but hey, don't worry. We'll we'll pull it, we'll pull it back together. We'll get those cows. We'll get that leather. We'll start that sugarcane farm. And oh god, the lava! I forgot I forgot about the lava there for a minute. Um, and yeah, and then we can uh, we can start working on the library. And the level thirty enchant. Oh my god. That is really bad. Wow, that. You would be. Uh. Mm. All right, I just bred these cows. Let's do some slaughtering and let's see how much leather I get from one cow kill, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. 10. Ooh, wow, we get over two leather for every cow. That's awesome. And a bunch of cooked beef. Oh, wow, I'm, I'm loving this. This is fantastic. Let's head back to the base. Hooray! Oh, check it. Oh, check it. Boom. Oh, one hit killing these spiders. Ah, yeah. Mm, Bane of Arthropods is literally the best enchantment you can get. I cannot think of a single better enchantment. Although wow, killing zombies is, is tough. Here, let's let's also just No, 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 I'm not gonna kill you, pig. I was going to, but he's a good pig. Hello. Hello hello. Here we can We can kill this guy with looting. Get an under pearl. Oh man, if he teleports outside though, he'll de aggro and go away, so we really have to kill him very quickly. See if we can make this work. Nope, instantly teleported. Darn it. Yeah, he's he's gone. He's not coming back. Oh man, sad face. Uh yeah though. Guess what we get to do now, guys? And this is this is exciting as balls. We get to grind a ton of leather and sugar cane so we can so we can set up some bookshelves for our library. Hur hooray! And we now have a sugarcane farm! Hooray! I just kind of randomly attached it here on, onto our other uh, farms. Boop. It just goes out into the ocean, as, as these do, and... Yep. There that is. Now we're going to go feed our cows once every five minutes. I'm literally just going to like set a timer on my phone for five minutes. You, that's how often you can feed cows, by the way, is, is uh, once every five minutes. But yeah, I'm just going to set a five-minute timer on my phone. I'm just going to feed the cows, start restart the timer. I'm just going to do that over and over again until I have fed the cows a whole bunch of times. Then we can have a huge slaughter fest. It'll be awesome. And lastly, I have built myself the ultimate cow feeding shelter so that I can just sit in here, AFK. And uh, even in the night, they, the monsters won't get me. And every ten, uh, five minutes, rather, I'll just feed these guys. I just fed them, so I can't, I can't show you that now. But we should have plenty of cows in no time. Aw, yeah, we got some mad cows up in here. Oh, uh, mm, yeah. Is so good. So we're just gonna we're gonna grab some leather from these guys. Uh, boop, 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 boop. Don't worry, we still have. I'm killing all the big ones. But we still got plenty of babies lying around here, and uh, they grow up to 20 minutes. So these guys are gonna 
You know, I, they, they all uh, got born... Oh, this, this one just grew up. They all got born at different times. Look at these two just growing up right in front of my eyes. Bad time to grow up, guys. Bad time. Um, but, but yeah, they all got born at different times. But uh, and a baby cow from being born takes exactly 20 minutes to grow into a big old cow. So check it out. We got another 27 leather from that. We can make a couple of bookshelves out of that. Not not quite as many as I'm going to need, but we can at least get started on the library now. Oops, and let's get over here and harvest our uh, sugar cane as well. Uh, yeah, though. Yeah, 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 yeah. Oh, man, this episode is going to take such a long time to get out. You guys won't see this for, like, freaking days and days after it was supposed to go up. Uh, poof, because I've been getting I've been getting mad, mad sorts of distracted up in here. I started, uh, I started programming a computer game. Like, I just... I, I've wanted to do it for a really long time, and I finally got started on it. So that has been... Very time consuming. It's been a very interesting, very fun learning experience. I've really been uh, enjoying it, certainly. But, uh, it, it certainly is taking up quite a bit of time as of late. Uh, <laughs> don't worry though, guys. After this video, next one will be up in no time at all. Haha. <laughs> so, believe me if, if you like about that. Uh, <laughs> yeah, though, we can finally get started on our library. So, I'm going to go make myself uh, some bookshelves up in here. And we can go uh, start building that, although I think we might actually be nearing uh, being out of time for the day per pretty soon here. But hey, we can at least get started, right? Oh yeah, oh yeah, making all sorts of books. Wow. Wow. So good. Uh, oh crap, wait, we don't have quite enough sugarcane. Oh no, we're one sugarcane short. Uh, I have more laying around, of course, but I have to go grab it, darn. It I actually, I have to do this right now, it's going to bug me otherwise. And there we go. Oh, whew. much better. Much better. Wow. I was freaking out briefly there. Oh my god, now we're not going to have enough wood, are we? Oh, oh no, we are. All right. <laughs> oh. And, uh, ah, we're one book short. Uh, only 25 books short. That's nowhere near enough. But, but whatever, whatever. We'll, we'll get there. We'll get there. Uh, yeah, so we're going to head out. We're going to head, head right on up. Right on up this way. Uh, and actually, this eye, this eye is kind of growing on me, that eye color. Oops, where am I going? Yeah, then we're going to head right up over here, right up over here. And this is going to be our library, all right? And the thing is, I want this library to be decrepit. I want it to be kind of creepy to be in. I want it to be very, very dark. And, uh, and I'm thinking maybe also very, like, kind of warm, almost. I know that when I talk about, like, dark and, and, and decrepit a little bit, it makes you think kind of colder. But uh, I think I do want it to be, like, sunk down into the floor a bit. And I think I do want it to be kind of warm. Maybe even put like a fireplace in here. Maybe make it kind of like a study. Uh, but what we want to do, we don't want to let too much sunlight in, right? So we're going to have these big old doorways. But immediately upon coming in, the floor is going to sink down a bit. And we're going to have a wall of bookshelves. I'm thinking right, right here-ish, right? In front of both of these doorways. Uh, and that wall is going to be bordered on each side here and here by, I think, some, some stone bricks, right? And uh, here, I'm actually, I'll go ahead, I'll just build this a little bit, and I'll, I'll show you guys what I'm talking about. Oops, oh god, I need a silk touch axe. F. Uh, one minute. Alright, 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 okay, alright. So this is what I'm kind of thinking right now, right? We have two just blocks of bookshelves here. Uh, I think this looks pretty good, I like, I like the nice dark wood here, but you might be thinking, oh man, this doesn't look bleak or depressing at all. This looks, this looks freaking happy as F, you know? Well, okay, alright, come me some slack. We need to put a roof on this, because I think that 90% of the mood I want to set in this library is going to come from the lighting. And right now, we've got a whole freaking bunch of sunlight shining in here. That that, that just that just ruins it completely. So we need, first and foremost, we need to get a roof on here. But I think that these little blocks, oh F, I think these little blocks of bookshelves I've got going on, I think they're they're looking pretty good, and I think that they're gonna look a whole lot better once we've got a uh, a roof on here. Oh gosh darn it! I, I'm having such a hard time navigating this area with the jumping. Uh, I need to I need to get this good. All right. Oh, oh yeah, there we go. Uh, yeah, though no valid spawning spaces on the floor. Everything is is stairs or half slabs or got like a fence on it, like right there. Um, and right now it's kind of cramped, but we definitely need to put something on the walls. We need to put more books on the walls, both on that wall and this wall. Because right now this isn't a library. This is two bookshelves, you know. And um, and I don't know what we're going to do with this little middle area here, but I definitely want to do something with it. So let's go ahead. First thing first, get a roof on here. And then we really need to figure out... I, I don't know. I, I might actually end up taking these blocks down. I think they look all right, but I'm just not sure about it. I'm not sure at all. Hmm... Okay, this isn't looking too bad now. Look, we, we got it nice and dark in here. I actually had to 
got into the floor, I had torches under this earlier, and I went down and I took them all out and I replaced it all with blocks because uh, I don't want anything spawning down there. But like you can see here, some light is kind of shining through, right? Like right... Yeah, right there. Um, and I went under and I, I... Actually, I don't know why it's shining through right there. What? Oh, it's because we have the back-to-back -back stairs going on, uh, and I can't I can't stop that. Like That's just how that is. But, uh, oh, oh god, can I even replace this? Uh, ah, no, I oh, got it, all right, cool. Um, yeah, so we had a bunch of, like, light shining through the floor, and that's, like, exactly the opposite of what I'm aiming for here. Oh, F, did I just get the... I think that's how that was, yeah. So, uh, we had a bunch of, like, light shining through the floor and ceiling, and I when I got rid of all that, now it's nice and dark in the middle here, and we can light this however we want. My ceiling pattern looks... It looks okay right now, uh, but this is not finalized in any way whatsoever. I definitely want to finish these walls on each side before I really decide what I'm going to do with the ceiling. This is more of a placeholder than anything right now, just to get the right sort of uh, nice mood lighting, or, or lack thereof, in here, uh, rather, yeah. Uh, on this wall, I'm thinking... Oh, oh, I'm walking sideways. I'm not touching my keyboard. I'm not... All right, cool. Uh, on this wall over here, I'm thinking we might put a fireplace. Uh, the thing is, though, we can't take out these blocks right here. We would have to make it come out towards us. Uh, and then, but but the thing is, we couldn't really put fire in there because it would burn our wood. We also have wood. Uh, who? Let's see if I can find a block I can break that'll show the wood. Crap! Ah, that, dang it! I got rid of another stair. Ugh, F. Um. I don't know. I might be able to do a really ninja jump move to replace that. Let's see. Hope, hope, all right, um, probably not, probably no, maybe, did that work? No, it sure didn't. Oof, this is a hard game, guys, Minecraft is such a hard game. Uh, I lost my train of thought completely, yeah, but there's, there's like wood, see these wooden pillars, there's some on this side as well, and fire can actually, uh, light other stuff through blocks, so like, that would be at risk, and I can't, I can't actually put fire in here, which makes me very, very sad. I wanted to have a fireplace in this room, but we might find some sort of alternative, um, and then on this side, I definitely just want more books just lining this wall. I, we might have that on this side as well, but somewhere in here, I want a chair. I want That's why I want the fireplace, so I can have a chair facing the fireplace, and it can be in a, my nice leather chair in my study, and uh, and everything can just be fine and dandy, and oh, oh my god, did I just get that? Nah, oh, darn it, so close. Maybe, um, uh, there we go. Ah, oh, baby, come back. You can blame it all on me. I was wrong. Down and down and now now banana na down and na 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 and it and it kind of fool could see um yeah well I completely lost my train of thought now I'm just blabbering this must suck as as footage oh Jesus so hey I'm gonna do more buildy thingy because I'm bad at this talking part of this so I'll just I'll just go back to the playing Minecraft part what do you, what do you say I'll see you soon. Alright guys, you know what? We don't have that much wood around here to burn, so let's just... Let's just try it, you know? Let's just set some fires. I'm almost positive that is within range to burn down my bookshelves. I'll stand here for a bit. I'll watch it. And, oh, you know what? Crap, that actually makes it much too light in here. I don't like that at all. We need to set this farther back in the wall. But we can't. Like, these are stairs that, that are seen from the inside of the hall, so, uh... I just have to find another way to handle this. Let's. I'll, I'll think about it. I'll think about it. Yeah. Right, yeah. So putting putting a fireplace in this wall not gonna work. Mm -mm. I also tried putting it in this wall. I actually decided like, oh, you know, this backpack pathway. It, it looks pretty bad, right? Like it's it's kind of small. Got all this nether brick here. So why don't I just like make the fireplace extend out onto this? You know, like make it so I can't walk this way, but it's fine because I can just walk through the library, right? Uh, and still get around, but but then I looked at it from outside, and I, I mean, I did that, and it made this wall from the outside just look her terrible, terrible, absolutely horrible, and you see, the, I just broke it and put it back how it was. Um, and yeah, I, I just wasn't feeling it, so now I'm thinking, alright, I, I really want a fireplace in here so I can make it like a study, right? Um, but I can't put the fireplace in either of the side walls, which, <laughs> guess what that leaves me with, guys? That leaves me with an option, a pretty good option, nonetheless. Uh, not nonetheless, uh, I don't know how to speak English right now. I'm very, I don't know why I'm being so bad at YouTube at the moment, but, uh, here's what I'm gonna do. I'm gonna remove one of these big bookshelf units. I'm going to seal up one of these walls, and I'm gonna make, I'm gonna make one of these walls the fireplace, right? And we'll just have one bookshelf, 
and it won't be symmetrical this way, but it'll still be symmetrical this way, which is fine. And we can just have a doorway in either the front or the back, and we can decide which side. I'm thinking... Ooh, I'm thinking probably... We'll probably put the doorway in the back, and the fireplace in the front, and my chair will face the front. So we're gonna, we're gonna knock out this whole chunk here, and we're gonna flatten out this ceiling and this floor, and we're gonna seal up this wall, and we can go from there. But hey, guys, you know, I think we're actually... Out of time for today, I spent a whole lot of time derping around, trial and erroring it up with this uh, library. I spent a whole lot of time, oh man, I wasted so much time when I, I had the stupidest death in the world because I forgot I had uh, set my game to hard mode. That was just, that was just a really dumb way to die. Um, and lots of unfortunate stuff uh, happened. Very, very slow moving episode, definitely not one of my proudest moments, but I do want to include uh, footage of, of all the interesting stuff that happened today. So I'm not gonna cut anything out. We're just gonna we're just gonna live with it. Next episode we'll get the library finished, hopefully right at the beginning, and then we can maybe also get my uh, bedroom finished in that episode as well. Um, but hey, yeah, thank you guys very very much for watching. I hope you guys enjoyed the episode, although it was a little slow moving, and I did spend a lot of time derping it. I just fed these guys. Oh, that one can get fed though. Maybe. No, that's just the one that. Yeah. All right. Whatever. Uh, oh no, two two kids. Uh, whatever. Yeah. Um. Yeah. Thank you guys very much for watching. Terrantor is out of here.